like in Malawi, as we are like growing up, we are pretty much most of like us, we are like farmers. We depend on growing our own crops. We grow corn, soybeans, uh, sweet potato. So pretty much most people who live like in rural areas, they depend on like planting their own food. If they are lucky, if they are planted enough of the food and they have uh, supplies, they can be able to use some of it to sell, to get some money that they can be able to help out with their families. So farming is very, it can be very like difficult and it can also be easy. There are a number of things that are making farming really like difficult to many people in rural areas. So in 2000 and the, 2000, 2000 to 2001 growing season, one of these problems, a lot of people like experienced it. There was drought in the country. As the results, a lot of people only harvested a quarter amount of what they were hoping to harvest. So to live up on that quarter, it was difficult to many families around the country. Incredibly, my family was badly affected by the situation. Soon enough, a lot of people started running out of food. A lot of people were starving to death. So at that time, it was the time that I was supposed to start my high school. And because of the situation, my parents couldn't afford to pay for my tuition. And I was forced to drop out of school. Schools in Malawi, primary schools are for free. While in secondary schools, you have to pay for it. So at that time, when I had like to drop out of secondary school, I looked at my father and looking at those dry field, it was the future I couldn't accept. I didn't want to become like him. I didn't want to become a farmer. It's not that I didn't want to become a farmer because I hate farming, no. I love farming. But I didn't want to become a farmer just because that's the only thing that I can do with my life. Which is the case to many people in my community. They are farmers not by choice, but they are farmers because of the circumstances that they are in. The only thing that they can do is to farm, to grow crops that they can be able to feed their families. So for me, I wanted to live the life where I can be able to do anything at any time that would be benefit, benefiting uh, my family and also helping me to do uh, anything that I need like, uh, to do. So for me, to get out of that cycle was through education. So when I had to drop out of school, it was really hard for me because that was the only way for me to get out of that situation. 